Good morning. Have you ever thought about how God, how big God is? You know, when you come to the ocean, it it's a uh, it's amazes me how big and vast and incomprehensible it is from my vantage point. Much like God. In Hebrews chapter one, he gives us this incredible introduction. The writer of Hebrews, what we have is four sentences is actually one sentence in the original language. And it's an incredible explanation that I want to share with you. In the past, God spoke to our ancestors through the prophets at many times and in various ways. But in these last days, he has spoken to us by his son, whom he appointed heir of all things, and through whom he also made the universe. The son is the radiance of God's glory, the exact representation of his being, sustaining all things by his powerful word. After he had provided purification for sins, he sat down at the right hand of the majesty in heaven. So he became as much superior to the angels as the name he has inherited is superior to theirs. This incomprehensibly big God is not who we find, but who reveals himself to us so that we can know him through his son. Would you pray with me? Father, thank you. Thank you for just your majesty, your holiness, who you are. Father, we love you in Jesus' name. Amen. Have a great day.